What's the stretching regimen that was used in the recent USATF study? Now there were three different stretches, four technically, uh, that they used. And the subjects uh, that were going to be stretching were supplied with a detailed stretch protocol that included the photographs of the stretch um, as well as images of what they were supposed to be doing. Now the first stretch was a quadriceps stretch. From a standing position, you need to grab your foot or ankle on the same sided leg and then pull your foot gently up towards your butt. You steady yourself with the opposite hand uh, and then you lean back to increase the stretch if you want to. Without bouncing, you then hold that stretch for uh, about 10 seconds and you repeat three times for each leg. The second stretch was for your hamstring. From a stranding position, you place the leg to stretch on, uh, on something so that you can elevate your leg. And then you lean forward over your thigh and try to reach your foot. Again, without bouncing, you want to hold that for about 10 seconds and then repeat it three times for each leg. The third stretch was for your calf and Achilles. From a stranding position, you want to lean forward with the leg uh, to be stretched straight out behind you, uh, foot flat on the ground, keep the knee straight for a full 10 seconds, and then flex the knee and repeat the stretch with the knee bent for about 10 seconds. Again, no bouncing, and you want to repeat that three times for each leg. If you want to do this routine yourself, I would make one small change, uh, and with the quadriceps stretch, instead of using the same arm as the leg that you're stretching, I would actually use the opposite arm. So for your right leg, you would want to stretch it with your left arm, and for your left leg, you'd want to stretch it with your right arm. The reason for that is it puts a lot less stress on your knee because it's a much more natural movement for your knee to be uh, going across your body a little bit instead of having it come straight up and towards the outside. So you're a lot less likely to, uh, to strain your knee to, uh, to a point where you might get hurt.